a monk. There was a fair for the mystery, and out rider that loved venery, a manly man to Ben and Abbot Abel, full many a dainty horse had he in stable, and when he rude men might his bridle hear, gingling in a whistling wind as clear and eek, as lewd as doth the chapel bell there as this lord was caper of the cell the rule of saint more or of saint benit by cause that it was old and some deal straight this ilk monk lit old things pace and healed after the new world the space he hath not of the text a pulled hand that saith the hunteress ben not holy ben nay that a monk one he is rec chelis in licknid till a fish that is waterless this is to say an a monk out of his cloister but silk text healed he not worth an oyster and i said his opinion was good what should he study and make himself in wood upon a book in cloister away to poor or swank with his handes and labour as austin bit how shall the word be served let austin have his swink to him reserved therefore he was a prick a sour all right grey hound as he had as swift as fowl in flight of pricking and of hunting for the hare was all his lust for no cost would he spare i saw his sleep pure filed at the hand with grace and that the finest of a land and for to festne his hood under his chin he had of gold wrought a full curious pin i love not in the greater and there was he heed was bold that shone as any glass and eke his face as he had been anoint he was a lord full fat and in good point his yen steeper and rolling in his head that stemmed as a furnace of a lead his boot a soup his horse in great estate now certainly he was a fair prelate he was not pale as a four-pinned ghost a fat swan loved he best of any roast his palfrey was as brown as it is a berry a frere there was a wantoon and a merry a limitour a full a solemn penny man in all the orders for in noon that can so mulch of dalliance and fair langage he had mad full many a marriage of younger women at his owen cost until his order he was a noble post full well beloved and familiar was he with frank lanes over all in his country and with worthy women of the town for he had power of confession as set himself more than a curate for of his order he was licentiate full 
Sweatily heard he confession, and pleasant was his absolution. He was an essay man to yive penance, thereas he wist to have a good pit once. For unto a poor order for to yive in seen that a man is well, he shrive. For if he hath, he durst make a vaunt. He wist that a man was repentant. For many a man so hard is of his hurt, he may not weep though him sore smert. Therefore, instead of weeping and a prayer is men moat, he have silver to the poor affairs. His tippet was I far said full of knives and pinnace for to even fair wives, and certainly had a merry note well could he sing and play an on a rote. O oh, fiedings he bar out to rely the priests. His neck wit was as a fleur de lis. Thereto he strong was a champion.